What's up, everyone? Big Gamer Lush. <sighs> Cheers. Not in the best of moods right now. Uh, understandably, I'm pretty sure you guys, if you've been part of the participating in the beta, if you guys have been either struck with 3102 or 9000. Gamer Lush! What does it read on the shot glass level? It's over 9,000! What 9,000? I have been struck with 3102. I was getting the link shell together, inviting people over, and when I actually had leveled up, and... <sighs> Sorry. It kicked me and my party out, just denying me and my party to log back in and try the game out. This happened Saturday night. Fortunately, my weekend schedule has been pretty bonk and kind of messed up, so I didn't have a really a lot of time to play. And so I can make some content and give you my opinions on the game. It's understandable, though. It is a beta. Beta phase 4. But, unfortunately, we live in a society where everything has to be now, 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 now. Fix it now, fix it now, give it to me now, I need it now, because of well, the internet and just how technology is right now. This was reported as one of the biggest opening beta launches for MMO in quite a while. Unfortunately now, because of this problem, they are going to get some very bad press. Heck, as the old saying goes, any press is good press, but not in this case. So, to the point where... A lot of people who have pre-ordered are canceling their pre-orders, asking for refunds, and what have you, just saying that the game is bad altogether, even though the game is very good at this point. I'm very happy with the, with the outcome of the game is. Now a lot of you are going to say, oh, you're just a Final Fantasy fanboy, and you think because, because they, they cannot do wrong. No. This is a f this is an F-up. This is just a pure F-up, plain and simple. This is what... Guys, this is what a beta is all about. So, those people will say I'm just a Final Fantasy fanboy and they cannot do wrong. No, they effed up. You guys can take your little simple-minded ideas and go on with yourself because this is how it is. It's like, that's a beta. They test this stuff out to find the problems with the game so this won't happen in the main launch for people who haven't pre-ordered. So, if you have that simple-minded little or single-minded thought in your head that, oh, this is a beta, this is messed up. Because of this mess up in the beta, not the official launch of the game, I don't want to buy it. This is... Okay, I can understand, it's like, oh, well, if this happens in the beta, why can't... Well, what happens if it happens in the middle of the game? Well, I can't do that. The, the problem... Okay. I was on all night Saturday trying to find a problem so I can get a video to you guys as soon as I possibly can but there's pretty much there wasn't really a fix I tried installing it start my computer looking on the forums and you know the one uh, this is a very common problem it just affected over 250,000 people that is a lot of people that is a big F up raise your glasses guys cheers And this this guy's kind of this stuff will happen. It's that the fact that it's, it's such a large launch. I'm I was angry. I was super angry because guys, for me, I took a day off from work, and I could use that money to save up for more graphics card. But I needed to play some to, you know, get some data for you guys to make a program, and so you know, make shows so you guys can watch so I can update you on the things. But you know, if I don't make shows you guys won't watch them because they get you guys won't think it's I'm updating them so it was a it was a catch-22 for me so if I go to work I miss out on money to save up the program to give you better programming if I go to work I couldn't give you the data that that are the information on the show so you guys can keep watching and help me grow the program this is a catch-22 and you know I love spending time with you guys I had a great time with the people that were joining in on the server that was another thing. They, I, 
I don't believe they anticipated the amount of people that were jumping onto this because there was a lot of you guys, and I'm sorry that you couldn't get on Diablos and you couldn't join me. But they are opening the they were opening the servers periodically and letting people and increasing the population cap on the servers to let you guys jump on. And they actually even opened three more servers, so which will later on down once the population starts to drop for a lot of MMOs, and I hope this doesn't. Uh, the more server thing kind of is like a almost kind of a bad idea. Just increase the pop cap if you can. I know this puts a lot of stress on servers and what have you. But guys, keep on trying because they did to fix the problem. Today I will be playing late night, late at night on Sunday into the morning, a Monday, late afternoon until I have to go to work. And by the time I get back from work, the servers will be closed. By that time, I'll be taking much pictures and getting my synopsis on the show, uh, on the game, as much as I possibly can. So if you're just now getting on this, or just watching this now, get back onto your character. They fixed it, or fixed the big majority of your problems, so get back on and play as much as you possibly can. Because, to make up for the mids, they have extended the open beta for one more day. I know a lot of you have been saying, oh, I've been locked out since the beginning of the beta. <clears throat> but... At least they gave us something. I kind of predicted the fact that like this is a big problem, so they at least would extend the open beta for a while. So you guys have until uh, have until Monday night or late or early, really super early Tuesday morning around two o'clock in the morning, or for a Pacific Pacific time, I believe. And so you guys still have that extra day. Me, this is not the most, not the biggest, but not the greatest thing that would happen to me because. Like you, like you, me, we all planned this out and took some time. It's like, I planned my schedule around this. I wanted to play. I wanted to give it a try out. But guys, as, this, as you know, as the uh, saying go, keep calm and game on. <laughs> Pretty much. So, go ahead. Get back onto your characters. If not, go to the forums. Sign up. There is a... Rule, there is a era 3102 and there's an era 4, 000, uh, 9000 forum they were opened up because when I was getting on them around Saturday they were totally shut down because of the traffic they're now lightening up go on there and Square will contact you as soon as they possibly can even though it, is, it has been a day I'll try to get this video out as soon as I can <sighs> this is like again guys I'm sorry so this week is probably going to be really low on Final Fantasy content Please stay tuned though, guys. Uh, when it pops up, I will be updating you on like when you put in your pre-order codes, and I will be making other videos of P Papers Please will still continue. Uh, I've been getting requests for to keep doing Drunk Star. I like playing those games. And I will probably continue to commit to those series. So guys, I appreciate your time. And I pre the people who s decide to stick with the game and wanted to stay with the beta and gave them a, a third chance. <laughs> well, I really don't consider this a third chance because yeah, the first game, when it launched, it was pretty terrible. This is still a beta. It's a beta, guys. A lot of people who get into the betas think this is like, oh, it's just a, a long extended demo. That's not the case. Betas are there to check these big problems out right now. I know you guys are frustrated and it's like, oh man, I plan on doing this and playing the game and then I can't believe they fucked up on this. It's like. The game still wasn't complete. That's what a beta is about. The game is not officially launched. Yes, they are in a week of launching the game. But you guys need to understand this is why they launched betas. To try this out. To see bug breaking or bug break game breaking bugs like this. This is this is exactly what they were looking for to see if, imagine if this were to happen on game's launch. It would be a catastrophe. Heck, it's a catastrophe right now because it's getting a lot of negative press right now. But I can see this. These are betas. I'm, I know I keep saying that, but this happens to a lot of other betas, and this is why they do pre launch. This is why a lot of games right now they do a pre test realm servers and stuff like that. So they can test the game out before they launch it for the masses to look at the game. There are still a lot of people who not have tried to scan this game out and are very and are ignorant to the what happened during the beta launch. Give it a try, guys. Just, just stick with it. Try the early access. You still have the early access to give it a try. 
And guys, I hope that they can get this stuff together within a week. It took them two days to fix the problem that was basically bug uh, game breaking at this point. So considering how it was such a large, this is a very large bug, and it took them two days considering not bad. Yes, it was two days, and they only gave us a day back. Yeah, they need to work on the customer service a little better. So, guys, just please, please take that in consideration. Uh, people who you know have canceled their subscription, just sit them down, calm them down. This is a bug that they enjoy the time that they had with the game before it broke. Because me personally, I was enjoying the time with the game, and it just it amplified with the fact that I was able to play with you, the my viewers, at the time. It was just so much better because the social aspect of the game, plus the game itself, was just great to play. The story. I've been leveling my Arcanist. I still. I still was able to get enough information to do my first 15 with the Arcanus. I know I did already two episodes with it, but those were basically data mines giving you an idea with it. This was my pure hands-on with the class, and I hope you guys will stay in to watch that. I will be releasing that later this week, and I'll be releasing other things like that. Unfortunately, I was able to try out PvP and the housing. Those were the two main things they wanted to test because I couldn't play the game. It was as simple as that. So, like I said, this was very frustrating for me. As you can see, I've been uh, just kind of racked with this. Cheers, guys. Sorry. So as you can see, my frustration is there too. So guys, don't worry. It, we're all frustrated or angry about this. But guys, play today. It's still up. And we'll be playing until early morning, Tuesday. And you know, uh... Guys, leave the comments below, you know, vent your frustration on the channel here and just let me know how guys, how frustrated you guys were. You know, leave your comments below. Heck, tell me if you guys were able to stay into the, stay into the game and tell me how much of a time, like if you had a great time, a bad time, you know, just go ahead and just relieve your frustration here on the channel and just leave your comments with it. I'd rather have you make a very angry, ignorant decision here on me than the actual game because what I experienced so far was great. I, I was super pissed off when they shut down or kicked me out and I couldn't log in. I did have some time to get on my Legacies player and get on that and play a little and take some pictures of that. So like you guys said, uh, uh, there was no fix for it during that but it's pretty much over. That's There's been a lot of people who trolled and basically put videos of just them putting up the screenshot that I showed up here earlier. And so they got a ton of hits and stuff like that. It's like, don't do that. That's just that terrible. It's like you're not being, you're not contributing. You're not helping anybody out. And a lot of these people click on it, seeing that how they can fix the 3102 problem. All right. So uh, future content, I will be releasing some videos on my first 15 with Arcanist. I will be experiencing my story, my experience with the story. That's pretty much it. Uh, I, I'll probably maybe have two to three episodes top at this point of uh, Final Fantasy content. I know that's pretty much what you guys kind of tune in for, and I apologize. That's my, I couldn't get more, but I was, I guess, I was just too, ex too excited. I was too excited to get into a party and join my guild members to, to play the game, and that's pretty much a lot of things that kind of a lot of people experience by like getting kicked out for 3102. They got kicked out trying to use Duty Finder. Duty Finder, you strike again. Damn you. Damn you, Duty Finder. They changed that too, actually. Instead of just walking in and just asking the person in front of the dungeon, they basically, when you hit the entrance, they put you in a Duty Finder with the, with either you're looking around or if you're with a group, they'll just put you in Duty Finder all automatically and just stick you into the dungeon. That's probably what the, the programming they did to put the kind of mess the game up a lot that's I that's my my thesis of what what may have screwed up the game a lot but that's pretty much it guys like I said re uh, reiterating I got booted I couldn't play for a day and a half we're gonna have low content in the week I apologize I appreciate all my link shell members who are gonna be part of the guild once I open a uh, free company once I open up guys please keep trying to log on Diablos and contacting me I'll put my name again here on the bottom 
contact me, shoot me a tell. Anyone is, anyone is welcome. PS3 players will be allowed to play with PC players. And just shoot me a tell. Let me know. Email below too if you guys are considering being officers or whatever. Or just want to be part of the guild. And, you know, if I'm not on the same time, I'll try to find you and shoot you a tell. That's pretty much it. And please stay tuned for Papers, Please and Drunk Starve. So let's end on a high note. My boy, Control Command Continue. I'll leave a link, a link in the description to his channel. He was a beginning supporter of my channel. I appreciate him. He's my boy from across the pond. Yes, uh, I'm, he's in Europe. I'm not sure which exact country he's in. And I don't want to insult him by saying whatever country that I think it's over there because of my ignorance. But guys, he's getting married the, the launch week of Final Fantasy 14 so much love for him and his fiance or wife to be and I hope I wish them the best of luck in their life and continuing that what and their life to continue on and this one is for you guys you beautiful people and thank you people uh, big uh, guys go over to his channel give him support he's been covering Final Fantasy as well if you guys are in the U uh, UE ser EU servers consider joining him in his guild I think he's going to be putting uh, some information what well, he's, he's got a video out now right now telling uh, I believe what his free company will be where he will be playing he will be playing on Ragnaros damn you for having the cool name server in the UE but buddy this is for you guys check out com uh, control command continue and this one's for you guys happy wedding guys and may you have a great honeymoon cheers and game on With that said, guys, if you like to enjoy your time with me, please like, subscribe, leave a comment below. Like I said, leave out your frustrations in the comment below. And I'll see you guys next time. Like I said again, I will say it again. Cheers and game on. This straight, no chaser. I'm gonna pour this thing in right in front of you. Oh god, looking forward to this. Uh, okay, let me put the. Last down. Yes, yeah, usually like, like you guys see me taking. I'm usually around four to three shots a day. Uh, a, a recording on a day. I record a lot of my videos usually in one shot or usually. So I kind of will waver on there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, taking this all in one hit is gonna. Ugh. All right. Thank you so much, guys. Cheers. This one's for you.